but nothing beats that first view uh, looking out the window as you're going up. It's never going to become routine. Going to space is difficult. But I think here in the near future, we are going to have more opportunities for people to fly in space. In the next year or so, we're going to have uh, commercial flights flying NASA astronauts, and that's the first big step. Um, you know, we've been launching people up to the space station. We've had a presence there now for over 15 years. So while the space shuttle has retired, NASA's space program is still going strong. We launched with the Russians. I'm just getting back from a, you know, five and a half month mission launching with the Russians. And so on the space station, we have uh, U.S. crew members there every day um, working hard, conducting science. So the program is really strong, and now we're moving more towards uh, launches back in the States. Well, I think the ultimate goal is for us to get to Mars and beyond. But Mars has been this goal that's been out there for a while. We've been studying it with the rovers. Um, so it's time for us to get humans on Mars. But it's a logical first step to go back to the moon and while we've been there before, it was very limited time frame, and we have new technologies that we want to test, um, not even on the lunar surface, but just orbiting the moon, getting some kind of a gateway so that we can go to Mars from there. But the plan that we're working for is getting to Mars in the 2030 time frame. And while for some people it may seem super far out, but it is, you know, it's not that far away. So I think it's a, it's a great goal to have, and that's what we're shooting for.